Interventional pulmonology is a subspecialty within pulmonary medicine that uses the latest technology to diagnose and treat a variety of chest conditions using minimally invasive techniques. My name is Dr. Eugene Shostak. I'm an assistant professor of medicine in cardiothoracic surgery. I'm a director of interventional pulmonology in the Department of Cardiothoracic Surgery, New York Presbyterian Hospital, Wild Cornell Medical Center. My name is Muhammad Sajawal Ali. I'm an interventional pulmonologist in the Department of Cardiothoracic Surgery and Division of Pulmonary Critical Care Medicine at New York Presbyterian Wild Cornell Medical Center. Interventional pulmonologist manages a variety of conditions. We manage lung nodules, disorders involving lymph nodes within the chest, diseases that cause accumulation of fluid around the lung, chronic cough from instability of trachea and bronchi, which is a condition called tracheobronchomalacia. And for patients with severe emphysema, we perform bronchoscopic procedure called lung volume reduction that improves breathing quality and quality of life. The most fascinating aspect about interventional pulmonology is the fact that it's a rapidly evolving field. We continue to leverage advancements in bioengineering, robotics, optics to develop tools that allow us to enhance patient care. One of the biggest frustrations for patients is that from the time of diagnosis to the time of treatment, there can be a delay. Some of those delays may not be significant medically, but emotionally they're incredibly challenging and they are important. By having people under one roof, often in one room, in one conference space, assessing a patient, you can really streamline the process and accelerate the management decisions. We provide a full service to the patient from the time we meet them to the time we do an initial consultation, taking them through their procedure and their follow-up. I think follow-up is very important and that really speaks to the integrity of my group. After the patient has their procedure, we see them in the office to discuss the results. We communicate the treatment plan to the patient. We call the referring physicians directly and update them. We are actively engaged in clinical research. We collaborate with other specialities in-house and also with institutions outside. I think it's very important because some of our patients may not have good options with regards to the existing standard of care treatments, and these patients can really benefit from enrolling in the clinical trials that we offer. A multidisciplinary approach is at the core of how we should deliver cancer care across the country. It has been shown beyond a doubt in study after study that multidisciplinary delivered care improves patients' outcomes. That is a fact. The collaboration between interventional pulmonology and thoracic surgery here is very unique at Wild Cornell Medicine because they are within our department. So almost every single case is reviewed by both a surgeon and a pulmonologist in addition to other providers. 